The last subtopic for chapter 5 is the applications of enzyme in daily life. It is known as immobilized enzyme technology. So what is immobilized enzyme technology? It is when it happens when the enzyme molecule remain at the same position throughout the catalytic reaction. Dalam arti kata lain adalah di mana um, immobilasi enzyme ini adalah satu method atau kaedah untuk melumpuhkan enzim itu di mana enzim tadi dipasangkan pada satu bahan inert ya combined with inert and insoluble substance iaitu material yang tidak larut bahan yang tidak larut so dengan cara ini it will increase uh, the resistance iaitu dia dapat meningkatkan ketahanan enzim terhadap perubahan contohnya perubahan pH ataupun perubahan suhu at the end of the enzyme reaction nanti, what will happen adalah the enzyme will easily separated from its product. The last subtopic for chapter 5 is from the diagram, you can see the application or the usage of the enzyme immobilization technology in the industrial application. You can see that the usage of the uh, immobilizations of enzyme in the medical sector and then the, the milk lactose free production, the pectinase and cellulose enzyme that, is, that use in the juice production, amylase, lipase and protease, also cellulose enzyme in the biodetergent, that consists in our uh, um, washing powder. The next one is about the leather production, which is the trypsin enzyme extract uh, the fur from the animals to make a leather product, such as a handbag, shoes, belt. And also we have the protease enzyme that will separate the fish skin. Here also uh, shows the applications of the immobilizations uh, of enzyme, which is the first one is the industrial production that involved in the medicals and also the antibiotics, beverage and amino acid. The second one is the biomedical application that widely used for the diagnosis and the treatments of many diseases. The third one is the food industry, the productions of the uh, fruit juice, syrup, the fourth one is uh, research in the research fields, which is to increase the efficiency of different enzyme. And then the biodiesel production, textile industry, wastewater management, and uh, not forgetting is a uh, detergent industry, which is uh, which one to find out which one is uh, very effective to remove the dirt. To ensure that you can understand the subtopic better, you can use the mind map uh, of the users of enzyme to make some notes and or your mind mapping uh, to make you uh, to help you uh, understand and uh, memorize all the important points there. So thank you very much for your cooperation. Thank you very much for watching this video. So don't forget to answer your quiz in the Google form with uh, with the provided link.